have a couple of baby deer. And the mosquitoes are horrendous. There's another one crying in the background. That's what drove me back here. My daughter says if the ears are straight, they're doing great. If the ears are curled, they're alone in the world. So, I'm not gonna get super close. I'm just gonna walk right up here. There's another one walking around, I believe. Yeah, they got straight ears. Very good little fella, very good. All right, one just walked off in the woods. I got another one right here. Again, straight ears. Can you see them? Very good, very good little guys. So that's three. And this one's just way too cute, curled up in a little ball. I'll be back looking for you guys, make sure you're all okay. Straight ears, I'm happy. You're just too cute. Alright, gotta go. Of course. As soon as I uh, get a chance to go out, the sky says, yeah. I'm gonna open up a little bit. And, well... I'm still going. Well, we got the simplex. All right. See you out somewhere in those fields. <laughs> oh boy. You see all these little bugs flying around me? Holy cow. Hey, you got me a good hole. Well, see the imprint. First uh, halfway decent signal other than a couple of Lincolns. I think it's a hinge of sorts, possibly, maybe. A lot of trash in this place, a lot of trash in this park. This is uh, the park that I got walked out of, right about over here somewhere is where I found that Walking Liberty. Um, I believe it was a 1942 uh, half, and um, uh, park's opened, yippee. This is not my favorite park, but it's the only one that's open right now. A bunch of birds flying around trying to catch all these little bugs, I think. Good for them. Woohoo! Alright, I gotta find another hole. Let's see? Hey, diggers! I think I got myself a barrel of a gun. A toy gun, that is. Very neat. Very cool. All right, not a lot of luck here. Oh, look at that casing. Smith and Wesson, Smith, blah, 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 blah. Smith and Wesson, forty. Very cool. Very cool. And it's starting to rain. Every time I'm out here, go figure. Then I start finding some cool stuff. All right. Very neat. Welcome back. All right, see you at the next. Hey, diggers! I think I found me a piece of a lantern. A few pieces of a lantern. Oh, wow. Very cool. Does that have the spinny thing? Ah, it's falling apart. I gotta dig the hole out. I wanna find that spinny thing. It might have the patent date on it. I'll be back. Hey, diggers. I got myself a spoon. Woohoo. I'm sure it's not silver on it. It does look like it's got some fancy on it. Very neat. I'll have to clean her up. I'll show you at the wrap up. Yeah, there's a little fancy on there. Very cool. All right, it's getting dark. Let me find some more. Hey, diggers. 
I think I got myself a button. See the imprint right there. Oh yeah. That's definitely what it is. Very cool. Very cool. It's got writing on the back. Let me clean it up. See if I can read it. Alright diggers. I don't know quite what that says. I don't know if you guys can see it. I'll have to wait till I can get a better set of eyes on it. it. Looks like it says Walterville at one point. Something like that. Alright, well, very good. Some old stuff here. We even got some shank. Alright, welcome back. Alright, gotta find another hole. See ya. Hey diggers! This thing look familiar to anybody? Feels like a solid piece of uh, brass. It's kind of green. Almost looks like it's got a place for almost uh, like kind of fingers. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. Kind of cool. Ooh. All right, working a new part of the farm field. Park was a bust, so glad I came here. Supposedly the, there was another house up around here. So we're gonna pick around through here a little bit and see what we can find. All right, guys. See you at the next. Kind of cool. Logging back. Found me a bunch of square nails up in the farm field. A couple odd pieces of metal. I think that used to be part of a pen. Um, this used to be a part of a knife. Um, and that just shouldn't surprise you. Um, all the good stuff. Hey, this is uh, what came out of the park. Not a lot. Uh, a few pennies. Didn't show those. Um, I believe this is a hinge. Really didn't bother cleaning it up. Um, and a barrel to a gun. Um, I pulled a bunch of... Uh, uh, can slot out of that place and it was just it was rough so i moved on to the farm field Woo the uh, farmer told me where they thought another house was so i went up there and that's where all those square nails came from and all this other fun stuff um well where do we start i wish i could have got the spinner off this um couldn't find it i'll go back up and look for it but uh i know it's up there somewhere but uh that's great i mean that's the perfect indication that you're on a nice old home site you know what i'm saying so um we got ourselves a spoon it does have that fancy on it like i said all right you probably can make out just a little bit of that fancy on there um it's not a lot it's not silver or anything so but uh it's kind of cool there's some there right in the back yep no no uh, uh manufacturer name or nothing so it is what it is Ah, uh, the button, the button. Woo, it is a two-piece. Well, it was a two-piece. It is a one-piece now. Um, it is uh, from Waterville, and uh, it's uh, MFG Co. Um, I did look them up. Um, they were in business around 1850 or so. Not quite sure how long they uh, lasted. But uh, um, it is a sportsman button, from what I can tell. Um, would got to do a little bit more research on it maybe i can put a closer date to it but uh that just uh, tells me that there's a lot of cool stuff up there um we did find that one nice shiny shell modern thought that was cool and this please please any help with this guys i would love it um don't know what it is it's heavy it's brass um it's got little spots for your fingers if uh these weren't bent i think i would have been able to get all four fingers in here so uh my question would be could this be some kind of a pull oh well, uh, your thoughts you know uh it's cool when you find something that you can't identify but you know it's old and you know you should be able to identify it and uh man i think this is definitely one of those items so i'm throwing it out to you guys and please help me on this if you can i would love to know what this is Drop it in the comments below. Um, hey, and when you're doing that, please hit that like button. And if you haven't yet, subscribe. Because we got a lot more adventures coming up. Boy, I need a new display case. This one's getting full. All right, guys, keep digging life. Because you never know what you're going to find. 
Literally. You never know. What is this? Please tell me. See it.